How's it going, everybody? I just wanted to do a quick video. Um, I've had to do your own gobo or isolation shield for most people. Um, you can more than likely go online and buy them for 100 bucks. There's a variety of different mic shields, but if you don't have the 100 bucks or the 100 or 200 dollars to purchase your own brand new, um, you want to kind of find an alternate solution. Um, online, there are tons of videos of how to do your own uh, gobos, and for most part, there are some great ideas. Um, but for most people, they're trying to figure out how to attach them on mic stands or a mic stand that is a boom. Um, I kind of came up with a pretty good concept. It's fast and easy, and it attaches within seconds on the mic boom. So let's take a look. And basically, it's about a foot and a half by a foot of black thick foam with a three-quarter inch in thickness. And then you have the foot and a half of the folder rods. Like I said, I divided them up into four quarters so it's evenly bent and I have that support when I apply that top foam on top of it. And all you have to do is go ahead and wrap it like you would a normal um, isolation pad. So here's the finished product, um, and it's mounted on my mic stand that's actually a boom. For most people who are trying to put up isolation shields, it's pretty heavy, and uh, either tacking on with zip ties or some type of fabrication, it's just bananas. But um, the best part of this type of shield is that it's very light. Um, and as you can see, what I've done is this last hanger uh, bar is right underneath the lip of the mic boom, and that's giving me the support that's going back and forth and it's holding pretty good actually and um, on the inside all I've done is pretty much made a cardboard retaining ring to hold that secure to the back of the uh, mic stand and then all I gotta do is go ahead and lay in some insulation foam on the inside to give you the uh, recording area you need for your mic and it's all set and you can take it up put it down for seconds you don't have any heavy items it's not taking up too much area and like I said, it's quick, easy, and you can move it off in seconds.